Kent. Yeah, an early morning fire damaged this apartment complex on Greenway Court, leaving more than a dozen people without a place to stay. Casey Baylor was there and spoke to residents shaken up by that scene. Thick smoke and bright flames covered the sky in West Ghent as firefighters fought a blaze at an apartment complex. Many residents in a state of shock watching the fire destroy their building. One of them, Michael Ose, an EVMS student who just moved in a few months ago. Uh, could be worse, could be better. I'm just trying to process it all. Ose is one of about a dozen residents who escaped the fire early this morning. I woke up to the sound of people banging on doors and the smell of smoke, I grabbed a shirt, put it on, sh sh uh, sandals, walked outside. Fighters rescued six others trapped inside the building. <laughs> Crews used ladders to help four people escape the top floors. There was a couple on the third floor on the left side of the building that, was still, that they were still inside. Uh, firefighters, I, I got to them, thank God. Four people were taken to the hospital with non-life-threatening injuries. Now, the fire began around 4.30 this morning on Greenway Court. Crews first went inside to help get people to safety. They began attacking it from the inside, worked interior for 30 to 40 minutes, and then ended up pulling everybody out because the conditions just got worse and worse. Norfolk Battalion Chief Stephanie Ramsey says flames quickly spread to the second and third floor. Officials upgraded the two alarm fire to a three alarm fire just after five. Though it's a very old building, um, it's, it's taken a real beating. With significant damage, parts of the building have collapsed and the roof has caved in. Ose is hoping to salvage whatever is left inside. I just want to make sure that everything's okay. Well, St. Andrew's Episcopal Church is helping those displaced. The church is opening up their building and is offering food and coffee and a warm place to wait as they contact others.